you in the wonderful name of our blessed Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the author and finisher of our faith and works, the one who is mindful enough to extend his love and his mercy towards us in that he put us to sleep last night. He allowed us sweet sleep and he rose us this morning. There are many people who would have wanted to be alive today, but are not because the time had come. The death knell had rung, and trust me, they are over there in the land where sailors go and never return. Praise the name of the Lord. We have an opportunity, brethren, where we can give God all the, not so, all the praise for his goodness. According to the Psalmist David, for his mercies endure forever. Praise the name of the Lord. Had it not been for the Lord, brethren, we would not have been here today. We have seen how wickedly man is operating on the land of the living. So we don't have to offend anybody for them to take our life. We don't have to owe them anything at all, brethren, for them to come and wreak havoc in our lives. But we bless God because we believe in him with all our hearts and all our minds and souls. Amen. Because of that great belief, he is allowing us freedom of movement, freedom of speech, freedom of association. Praise the name of the Lord. There are some people who, who went to hard to win a house of water today and can't go because of the states of the land. But we are a free people. And my God said, if the Lord has made you free, you are free. Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. We are overcomers. You are not overcome. We are overcomers. Because the devil is really on our, is getting at us. But he can't touch us yet. Some of us are allowing him in our lives. But let me tell you something, church. We have the power of choice. That is one of the greatest gifts God gave to us, apart from his son. The gift of choice. Choose in his day whom you will serve. Praise the name of the Lord. If you choose to, to, to serve Satan, go serve Satan. And suffer the consequences. If you decide to serve the Lord, bring eternal life. Praise the name of the Lord. So today, we are hoping that we're going to swing the doors of our hearts open. Not open. We are going to swing the doors of our hearts open and speak the Lord's sake and save us to come in and abide. As we open the service by taking the general consciousness. Almighty and most merciful Father, we have all that free from thy ways and mercy. We have followed from our devices and desires of our hearts. We have offended in thy holy law. We have left undone those things which you have to have done, and we have done those things which you have not to have done, and there is no help in us. But the world have mercy upon us, this horrible offender. Pray that the Lord confess their faults. Restore those under the offender. Them that are offended. According to thy promises, declare unto mankind in Christ Jesus, O Lord. And grant the most merciful Father for his sake, that you may hereafter live a godly, righteous, and sober life to the glory of thy holy name. And the let us pray, Lord, pray, our Father. Lord, Lord, in thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done to love as a citizen. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil, for thine is the kingdom, and for the glory, for ever and ever. O Lord, open thou our lips, O God, lift thee to save us. Glory be to the Father. Again from the dead, yes, and it is the right of the Father Almighty. 
today, let me show you how we're going to run it up. Today is our fast Sunday and it's our communion day. For those who would like to participate or partake of Holy Communion, all of us start to consider ways of doing that. Then we have the dedication of the baby. And then we have the general service to carry along. So here how we're going to do it. After I would have prayed, I would ask the parents to come up and do the dedication of the baby, get that out of the way. Then we're going to go into the Holy Spirit. No, we're going to continue the praying. Maybe two more or three more persons will pray. Then we would go into the Holy Sacrament. You see, I say prayer because prayer is the only measure by which we can we can purify ourselves. Are you with me? Yes. So because this Holy Sacrament is something that we can't play around with. Right? And then we will go into the general soul. Alright? Praise the name of the Lord. There's a gentleman stand sitting in the back of the door. Please stand up, please. Yes. Yes. I want to say something to you. Do not count it as offensive, eh? But 